Tragedy on the highway tonight. A construction worker is dead after a semi tractor trailer slammed into him on the job. Good evening. I'm Danita Harris. And I'm Lee Jordan. These workers are in great danger every day. The scene was Interstate 77 at State Route 82 in Brexville. News Channel 5's Dan Haggerty is just back from the scene. And unfortunately, Dan, this is not the first construction zone crash in that area. Right in that stretch of road. There were two others before this one, Lee, but this accident. Is the first to be deadly. You can see the skid marks leaving the northbound lanes of I 77 near the Royalton Road exit. Police say 59 year old truck driver Jesse Carter hit and killed 40 year old John Koslow, a construction worker from Akron, around 10 30 this morning. That is an ad lane job that started back in 2008. They're just finishing up some punch list work in the area, and they were, they were setting up just a typical right lane closure. According to ODOT, the construction project was scheduled to be finished in just weeks, and Koslow was working near a company vehicle with a flashing sign warning drivers. There weren't any barrels out at the time. This was, they were just getting started setting up this work zone. The barrels are kind of the last thing to go up. The signs go up first to let drivers know what to expect ahead. This is the third accident of its kind in this area during this work project where a worker has been injured or killed. ODOT told me alcohol was involved in the first two. In this case, Carter has not been charged, but the Brecksville Police Department is investigating why he left the road. We stopped by his home in Maple Heights tonight, but he wasn't home. And Carter will most likely be charged with reckless operation, but police will be checking the condition of his truck and the brakes, Carter's blood for drugs and alcohol, of course, and his cell phone records for texts and calls. Reporting live tonight, I'm Dan Haggerty, News Channel 5. Dan, have you found out anything else about this truck driver? Well, we did some digging, Lee, into Carter's driving records. The Ohio BMV shared with us in these documents that Carter has had 11 traffic tickets since 1999. Six of them were for speeding, five for seatbelt violations. That's all we know for now. Okay, Dan Haggerty reporting. Thanks, Dan. Thank you. And